number six, determine the next two values in the sequence. Now this is using inductive reasoning skills. We're gonna try to observe a pattern and then use that pattern to project out into the future um, or into our next things in the series. So at first, you know, this isn't one of those simple patterns where we're just adding the same thing every single time or we're multiplying by two every single time. It looks like your numbers go up and then back down and back up and down. Now, whenever I say that though, I'm saying up, down, up, down. I'm wondering if there might actually be two patterns on top of each other. So here I've got 17 and then 19 and then 21. That appears to be that as I go from here, I'm adding two. Then across the bottom, I've got 50 and then 45 and 40 which means that I am subtracting five on both of those. So if that pattern were to continue, the next thing I would do is add two again to get 23, and then I would subtract five again to get 35. 